Hey. Hey. How's Marlon? Yeah, he's gay now. Mm. It's just a bit of a shock for us already, wasn't it? Yeah. Look, I'm, I'm really sorry, Belle. Well, what for? I just I didn't get why you left like that. Come on, you should tell her. Tell me what? Nothing. It, it's... I, I, sorry, I, I can't do this. Sorry. What's all that about? He's had a difficult time recently since he was stabbed. And he's been having panic attacks. Mm. Quite possibly PTSD. I had no idea. What are you expecting? Alice? Oh, sounds like Belle. No, 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 no. I don't really want to see her. Want me, want me to tell her to do one? Look, I know you're in there because I saw you walk in. Too late. Jesse told me what happened. Right. Well, it would have been nice to hear it from you. You've had your own problems. Well, all the same. Walking out on me twice in a few days, any girl would think she stinks of BO. No, 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 no. Alice, well, it was... I'm joking. Right, yeah, sorry. Well, I'm here now if you want to talk. I don't, really. Here, yeah, Artie. Right. I'll make myself scarce. I need to be somewhere. So? I don't really know where to start. Well, you can start by making me a cup of tea. I knew something was up. I knew you disappeared like that. But I was just worried that I'd scared you off. Well, you hadn't. That is a relief, because I have not had the best of luck with boys. Not that I'm saying we're a thing or anything. <sighs> Why would you want to go out with a nutter like me, anyway? What, you think you're a nutter? You do know my history of mental health, don't you? I've heard a few stories. All true, I'm afraid. I'm the weirdo that hears voices and killed a best mate. I don't get how you can, how you can joke about that. It's... Because the alternative is to just shut myself away, to not see or speak to anyone, and I've tried that and ended up getting sectioned. Oof, we in some sort of competition. <laughs> <laughs> well, if we are, then I am winning, hands down. I'm not trying to make light of it, but I have been there. And I know what you're going through. We've got a lot in common. How did you get through it? Well, to be honest, I... I haven't. And I don't think I ever will, but now I know that the voices aren't real and you just learn to cope. How? I'm on medication and counselling. That's really useful. But you should ask for help. And then hopefully you'll find someone to confide in. I am free for another drink, if you want, just as friends. I think it's best we both leave it for now. OK, yeah, if that's what you want. Sorry. No, you, you have to do what's best for you, but... I did mean it. You can't get through this alone. Yeah, I'll get help. Good. And you know where to find me if you do change your mind about that drink. 